Hey guys, in this video we will be seeing how to apply the iOS 11 fonts on most of the Android phones and Samsungs. It is definitely going to work in all the Samsung phones as it is going to work in my S9 Plus and it may work on most of the Android phones as well. So let's see how it goes. And change it actually without even rooting the phone. So here we go. We will be, we can use iOS 11 emojis which look somewhat like this and so for doing that we will be going to browser and installing a TTF file whose link is given in the description and I will be starting my download. It is already downloaded in my phone so I won't be downloading it again. Now we have to go to play store to download an app called a font for Samsung. So if the uh, play store version works on your device after performing all the steps then it's okay and if not there's a link in the description for that as well. So currently the app version is working on my phone so I'll be installing it. After installing I am opening the app and now I have to go to the plus add button and create a new font. Confirm allow. So basically we have to see an ad to do a custom font. So I will be going and seeing the ad. Close the ad. Just typing any random name. Compatibility for Oreo. Continue. Select the TTF file from the download you just downloaded. Now the app is saying that the font is being processed. So the app failed last time but it succeeded this time. I will be going and installing this font pressing install install for oreo so in, in order for this app to work is that you after installing you have to restart your or reboot the phone so i'll be pressing continue so if you haven't removed the security setting from the settings do it now and allow this from this source install done now you have to go and restart your phone now after restarting my phone i am going to the settings display mm, font and screen zoom and i'll be selecting the iphone which i which i just download uh, installed on my phone uh, see the font is going to be a little bit wider on the phone after you apply it so you have to get used to it but it is very less noticeable on the phone so you can get used to it so i am going to apply it you just saw that the notification bar is quite wide now the fonts are taking a little bit more space but it's quite acceptable now i'll be going to see how the fonts have been changed now you can see we have the iOS fonts which was not here before. So this is how you can change the fonts in your Samsung or most of the Android devices. Thank you for watching.